Hello cliche, g'day guys and welcome to the lobby of the walls. Woot woot. I love this game. I actually started disliking it a little bit because no matter what team you're in, your teammates troll you. Uh, I always tip, uh, pick team green. It's my favourite colour. Um, last time I picked team red and completely derped it because in the end it was red versus blue. But because the enemy name turns red anyway, um, I faced a blue member thinking he was on my team and he walloped me right in the face. So it was an epic, epic fail on my behalf. Uh, now this map is, uh, it's called Aztec. I haven't done this one before. That looks awesome. That looks really cool actually. Um, I usually go to jungle because there's a little spot that I know uh, that when you dig a, la or a ladder, a stairwell straight down, you actually do about a 20 block drop into water. But uh, yeah, you land right in the bottom of a ravine. So here's the game. See inside people's faces, that's awesome. Oh, if only I could build something like that. Do, 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 do. Surprised somebody else didn't come along and steal all this weight. Hey, look at that. I'm getting loads of seeds and no weight. That's awesome. So it's the usual. What I might do with this one, folks, is have a nice little editing of it so you don't get bored with all the blah blah building, blah blah crafting. And we'll get into some actual gameplay. Well, here comes time for fun, folks. This is when I find a really great spot and somebody starts stealing things from me. I've learnt from this, never leave a furnace unattended um, at your own risk, basically. People are just, oh, they're just lazy. <clears throat> You go and do all this fine work, gathering iron ore, gathering coal ore, making your furnace, and um, and people just come along and nick it. But now that I say that, this will probably end up being one of those walls episodes where all of my teammates are absolutely beautiful. So we'll see. But I'll do another little cutaway now, I reckon. And um, again, bring you back to uh, something worth watching. This is actually really creepy and I've got a feeling that I'm going to get lost. There's a lot of stuff going on in here. But like I said, I haven't actually done this one before, so I'm not quite sure where to go. Probably worth putting a couple of torches around just in case. Always in my nine spot. Um, there we go. So let's have a little Luke see down this way. There's chests everywhere. Which does also mean that the other side is getting a pretty darn good advantage as well. Thought he was about to steal my torch then. That would have just been mean. Look at all these chests. Oh nice, a label. He is actually doing really well on the uh, finding of the iron ore side of things. So maybe I should be a bit more proactive about that myself. Speaking of. I have a look-see. Every time I see those fence posts under here, it feels like there's going to be a uh, abandoned mine shaft. Not always the case, though. Still got to be wary. Actually not quite sure if uh, if mobs are disabled on this or not. But it's all part of the fun. And how much all the better for you guys watching me squeal when a creeper creeps up behind me. Or I suddenly walk face to face with an enderman. That would just be typical. This is absolutely littered with coal and iron. Which again, I mean, you don't think till it's too late that sure you're having all the luck finding all this stuff, 
but that generally means so is the other side. I'll let him have that. That's only fair. I found, what have I got here so far? 22, I believe it's 20, 26 or 27 to get your full set of uh, sword and armor. I'm pretty well loaded up with coal now, which is great. But whether I'm going to be nice enough to share it, I don't know. I don't troll other players, but uh, I have learned my lesson about being too nice too soon. I tend to end up... Uh, Martyring myself off to, to the death. This looks a little uniform, so there's got to be something planted here. There we go. This is actually probably the quickest I've ever found the full set of iron ore. And another chest. Look at that sneaky bobos right there. And look, some iron boots already. Come on. Golden pickaxe. Meh. Not really bothered. Could leave that stuff. Give somebody the TNT. I think this guy's following me. Are you following me? I don't know. He's kind of being nice as well. Is he purposefully missing? No, there we go. I thought he was missing that iron ore. All right. Let's uh, go back to the little uh, cavernous place down here. See if there's any parts we've missed like that. Holy moly. Ah, uh, there's no way of getting down there by just... Oh, I wish there was water. All right, let's see how we go. Making my way. Making my way downtown. Um, later on tonight, I do expect that uh, Doofith Jr. Uh, I'm feeling Sergeant Cartman definitely. I'm totally going to die here. Perhaps even Jason, better known as I'm a fire in my laser. Uh, will be on, so we'll hopefully get to do a video uh, together again. And will actually be a post of my POV. This is why I'm so excited. It's, I've got to give a lot. Oh, somebody's already tried that. Look at all that equipment down there. Oh, somebody died. I could probably go from here. I got somebody stoof. That's a load of stoof. Oh well. Reap the rewards. Take advantage. This is actually the luckiest I think I've been in this wall series. If somebody fell, they uh. Oh no. Okay. Don't need that. Don't need that. I definitely want that. Can't use that. I'm crap with using that. Oh, wow. I'm not going to say it, but whatever that is directly in front of me, it's in its natural habitat, so I'm not going to touch it. And we all know who that ode goes out to. I think it's about time, with a little bit more coal, just to be on the safe side that I head up to the surface and start some cooking. Gotta cook some coal. Derp -de derp And the slow... Oi! Get off me. Get off. Get off. Hindrance. The slow descent back up. Folks, what's the best way of doing this, I think? If he pushes me off, I'm going to be very annoyed. <laughs> That's what you get for staring at me, because staring's just rude, really. This must be the way I came. Or not. Okie dokie. Better. Okay, now how the heck do I get out of here? Is that a tier 2? Oh, yes. When in walls, dress appropriately. Skelly face. I've got two of them. Oh, look at that. Skeleton face with my afro. That's amazing. 
Wait, give it back. Okie dokie. Never dig up. Rule number two in Minecraft. Rule number one, never dig down. Oh well. What's going to happen? I'll die. Or break my pickaxe. I'll tell you what, I I'm, I'm, can't wait to have the boys on this as well. Because it's all well and good me actually having a go. And doing this on my own. But it does make such a difference when there's other people chatting with you. The banter back and forth. Um, I can only do so much on my own. Hello, life. Oh, feels good. Feels good. Okay. And you know what I did? That enchanting table. Gosh, it's so much effort being me. I've got the funniest feeling I'm not going to end up posting this because it is just a little bit silly. But you know what? Sometimes the silliest are the best. Ow. Ow. So we'll see how we go. Oh, nice enchanting, folks. Now, let me be nice. I'll give him that. He can have some redstone. He can have the TNT. Uh, I don't want to damage him. I don't want to poison him either. Oh, shoot, the walls are down. Oh, well, I didn't leave myself any time, did I? Let's go kill people. Shall we? And I'm stuck in a hole. That's fantastic. Hey! And there we go, folks. That was it. So I didn't leave myself enough time to do any smelting, any cooking of my iron ore. I yoloed straight into the middle and... Um, had somebody come right at me, bro. So that's the end of this. Look at me, I'm all ghosty. That's the end of this video then. Um, this has been Carrot Top playing the walls. Um, and uh, you'll be seeing me again soon. Catch you later.